What's up, tennis athletes? It's Chris Heria. We're at home because today I'm gonna to be giving you a super effective chest workout that you can do right from your house just using pretty light pair of dumbbells and different push of variations, emphasizing and engaging different areas of your chest from your split to your outer, your lower to your upper, giving you a complete chest workout. I'm gonna be showing you different tips and exercises that help me personally along the way when trying to define certain areas of my chest, like the split, upper chest, and the lower chest. And when working out from home, most people don't really have any equipment other than just a pair of dumbbells. Although I have made videos in the past of intense chest workouts where I've gotten a crazy pump only using push up variations. But today we're gonna to compound that effect by adding weight and supplementing this routine with some dumbbells. It's very likely you're not going to have heavy weights in your house, but we're going to ensure hypertrophy by doing drop sets with higher rep ranges and dumbbell exercises going straight into our push-ups, increasing the time under tension. So if you're ready to get a super effective chest workout right from home, have your dumbbells ready to go, and then just download the Thenix app from the App Store or Google Play Store if you haven't already so that you can have this routine and properly follow along. Open up to the YouTube workout section and you're going to be able to find this workout. There's a warm-up that you can do at the top if you're not already warmed up. For everyone else ready to go, smash the like button. Let's start with the first exercise, dumbbell one-arm press. For the first two exercises we're going to emphasize on each pec individually you can start off with both hands up 10 on one side 10 on the other one if you want more of a challenge you can bring this one down too Squeeze your core, squeeze the grip. Make sure your elbow is lower than your shoulder. All right. There we have the first exercise, isolating each side of our pec. This is gonna build strength in each individual side of our pec. It'll also help muscle imbalances, which usually lead to injury, which will also help you break plateaus and progress a whole lot faster. Let's go emphasize on each pec individually again with assisted one arm push ups. Now you can do this on an elevated surface for all my beginners. Everyone else, get down on the ground. We're gonna have one arm out, one arm pushing, 10 reps, both sides. All right, switch it up. All right, you should definitely be feeling the pump in your chest already. Now I'm gonna show you two exercises that I use that really help me define the upper split area of my chest. The first one is gonna be twisting dumbbell presses. We're gonna go for 15 to 20 reps, depending on your fitness level and how much weight you have. So you wanna come all the way up, twist, touch, and then come right back down. Make sure your dumbbells are at your chest level. You want them too high and start emphasizing too much on your shoulders. Your elbow should definitely be below your shoulder line. Twist, come right back. Twist, squeeze, and then come right back. Nice and controlled. Increasing the time under tension. Really squeezing, helping to reach hypertrophy. Squeeze. Last one. All right. There you have it. Next, we're going to go into elevated diamond squeeze push ups. We're going to be using an elevated surface just like this. You want to put your hands in a diamond, come straight down to your chest. Come all the way up and squeeze. Try to get your pinkies to touch. Keep your core tight and push up form, perfect form. Squeeze every time you get to the top. We're gonna be going for 15 to 20 reps.
One more. All right. Whew. My chest is on fire. And all the way down from the split, I have a crazy pump. We're gonna keep moving on. Next two exercises, we're gonna emphasize on our upper chest, which is usually the area people lack the most in. And usually because there's just not that many exercises that use that pressing angle. Whereas other exercises that you may do in other days may be indirectly working different areas of your chest. As pressing straight or down is a lot more common of a movement. That's why I really like to emphasize on my upper chest and split on my chest days. So coming up next, we have supinated dumbbell twisting presses. We're gonna go for 15 to 20 reps and then drop into our pushups. So we're gonna start supinating squeeze your core press all the way and twist all the way up come all the way back down press up Last one. All right, there you have it. Moving right into our push-ups, we're gonna go for decline push-ups, again, emphasizing on our upper chest. So find a surface you can put your feet on. We're gonna be going for 15 to 20 reps. If you can't do that many, just max out. And definitely don't be putting your feet on your mom's couch. Better be your own couch. And of course, the lower the elevation, the easier it's gonna be. The higher the elevation, the more body weight you're applying, but the more gains to be made. Let's go, 20 reps. Keep that form perfect. Squeeze the core. Breathe. All right, nice little set. We are almost done with this routine. Next, we're gonna be working our outer and inner chest with the next combo, starting off with dumbbell flies. 15 to 20 reps. You wanna make sure that you're flying at your chest level, not at your shoulder level. Squeeze. Keep your core tight. Regulate your breathing. Give it a nice full range of motion. Let your chest stretch every time you get all the way down. Give a nice stretch in your chest, bring it back. Last one for good luck. All right. There we have it. All right, now we're gonna take it down to the ground and go straight for some diamond push-ups. We're gonna be going for 15 to 20 reps. If you can't do that many, just max out. Do as many as you can right here on the ground and then move up to an elevated surface. Give it a full range of motion. There we have it, my chest is on fire. We're gonna finish off this routine with two body weight exercises, starting off with dips, emphasizing on our lower chest and our triceps. You could put two chairs together and go for some legit dips, or you can just use the side of a surface like this. Go for bench dips, it's gonna be a bit easier as well. All the way down, all the way back up, 20 reps.
back on the triceps. Last one. Good luck. All right. We're gonna finish off this routine giving it everything we got with explosive push-ups. For my beginners, I want you doing this on an elevated surface. Everyone else, start on the ground, then move to an elevated surface if you need to. Perfect form. Let's go for it. There you have it, crazy pump in the chest, working the entire chest from our upper, lower, mid, split, and outer. And as you can see, you can make some crazy gains from home just with the light pair of dumbbells and some push-up variations. And of course, a couple minutes of your dedicated time, consistency, and having the right programming, of course. So remember to get this workout on your phone, schedule it at any time, and get full access to all our workout programs as well. Make sure you've downloaded the Thetics app in the App Store or Google Play Store. And not only will you have full access to all our workout programs, but our technique guides that will teach you the most advanced movements step-by-step, step, like the full planche, handstand push-ups, muscle-up, human flag, and so much more, as well as daily workouts sent straight to your phone to kill your plateaus and to make sure that you stay making gains. And you'll be a part of the Thanix community with millions of Thanix athletes around the world getting in the best shape of their lives with the Thanix app right now. So make sure you download the Thanix app in the App Store if you haven't already, and congratulations to everybody that got through this routine with me. You're on your way to building a solid chest, and the more you do this routine, the stronger you're going to get. Eventually, you're going to be able to go for more rounds. And to benefit the most out of this routine, you want to be able to do it for at least three to four rounds. So come back to this routine each week to make sure that you're getting a complete chest workout. And if you enjoyed the video, please smash that like button. We really appreciate it. And it helps YouTube share our videos to more people out there. And to show our appreciation, if you comment down below within 30 minutes of any upload, you're always going to have a chance to win some Thenix gear. So hit the subscribe button with bell notifications on right now so that you never miss a chance on a new video. We post every single Sunday, 8 p.m. USA Eastern time. And for more of my content during the week, make sure you're following my vlog channel. That's youtube.com slash Chris Heria, my Instagram and my TikTok as well. On every single upload or post, I always do some type of giveaway. So if you want a chance to be a part of that, make sure you're subscribed, liking, and commenting. And that's gonna wrap it up for today's video. If you have any other great ideas that you'd like me to cover in the next video, please let me know down in the comment section below. And I will see you next Sunday, 8 p.m. USA Eastern Time. Mad love and peace out.